It is 5.15 a.m. Minnesota time. Wow. But we're in London and we're in a pub. <laughs> Not yet noon, so still early. Did you sleep on the plane? Not very much. Me either. The drinks came... I drank a lot. The drinks came hot and fast. We tried to have a drink for every place we were. <laughs> Jack Daniels. Jack Daniels. Canadian Club. But when we reached Ireland... They were out of Irish... Uh, Irish cream. Yep. Or they were refusing to serve I us. think they were refusing. <laughs> It's not like we were unruly. I think we're just trying to recover. <laughs> We've had a day already. Yeah, yeah, quite a day. Eight hours to get here. An hour to get out of the airport because we had to go through customs. And uh, probably another hour by underground to mm -hmm. get here. And we're right outside of Paddington Station because yeah. we're going to continue Yeah, we continue say where traveling. we are. I don't even think we said we're in London. Did I, oh, I just I did. I think you did say you're in London. We're exhausted. <laughs> but but we're at a pub called the Victoria. Yeah. Very pretty place. It's gorgeous. A couple hours we're going to catch a train to Bath. Bath. It's where the Roman baths are. Correct. We're going to go take the cure. Yeah, take the waters. We're going to see your old house. Yep. Yeah, I lived here when I was 10. But first we're going to wander around Paddington Station for a couple of hours. Mm-hmm. And take the cure. <laughs> so say where you bought that again. I can't remember the name of it right now, but it's... W eight. Something. Something. Yeah. It's a it's a magazine shop in Paddington Station. I thought he was just going into a magazine shop, but this is it was the same shop he used to buy this comic. Yeah. When he was ten. When I lived here when I was ten, yeah. I didn't know. That's really cool. Does it look the same? No, it looks a little different. <laughs> A lot more focus on Judge Dredd. No, I mean, <laughs> I mean oh, the, the store. Oh, the store? I can't remember it all that well. You see this little note here? Picture of Dickens. A little note that says he wrote our mutual friend here. These stairs are precarious. Charlie Chaplin spent a lot of time in our local area. An old landlord story tells of Charlie standing on the first floor balcony of the Victoria whilst a crowd cheered from the street below. That balcony up here. Once again, I'm pretty uh, rusty at vlogging, so we ate all the food before I turned on the camera. Buttered mash. Really rich cheese. Some with assorted greens, tomatoes, capers. Onions. I've never seen a caper do this before. What do you want to say about the salad? Duh. And salad. I like the mix of greens. Usually in America we just get, well, usually just iceberg. But these are really, really gardeny. Kind of, have kind of a rustic flavor to them. We have just gotten on the train, the Great Western Railroad, to go to Bath. 
see what happens. <laughs> they just close the doors. We've repeatedly checked, so apparently <laughs> this is a lot. our... We're on the move. Yeah. Moving backwards. We're going backwards. I mean, that's almost literally true for me. We're going back to bed. We're going back to bed. Everybody closed up for the bank holiday, or does stuff just close early here? Yeah, I mean, it's like 7 p.m. We'll probably find some restaurants so it's still open. God, this is a pretty town. It really is. You can see that everything here is made of this. Wow. <laughs> All made of this uh, light colored sort of sandstone looking stone. It's called the bath stones. Local oh. quarries. I haven't been here in so long, I forgot that everything is made of it. Like, this is the most unified looking downtown I've ever been in. Just yet. Never very far from a prep. Do you remember what this is supposed to be? <laughs> I can't. Some kind of surprising animal. What is it? I think it's supposed to be a groundhog. Oh, a groundhog. <laughs> I think. Already not the most recognizable animal. Do you remember took, when we saw it? It took us all night to figure out what the heck we had seen. We were staring at it for an hour, being like, is that a beaver? We know it's not a that? beaver, but what else could it be? And then we saw the muskrat, and we were like, is that a groundhog? Oh, groundhog. Every, every new rodent no, we see. No, it wasn't. It was a. Groundhogs are tiny little things. No, groundhogs are big bad guys. Big bad guys. <laughs> they're full of rage. Haven't I you seen groundhogs? They're like, they're like this big. Oh, that's right, because of Groundhog Day. Yeah, muskrats are about this big. I'm thinking of prairie dogs. They're, they're, it's all rodents. They're all rodents of various sizes. And adorable. And adorable. There goes Whoa. the Megabus. Headed <laughs> to Chicago, only six bucks. <laughs> thing about gin that you just said, we say it again. Let's go get some gin. <laughs> Smash cut. <laughs> That sounds perfect. I'll absolutely. Get Would you like it the same as that? No, I'll get it in the with the GMT. Absolutely, sir. So I'll serve that with a lemon twist and some juniper berries. So I would advise not to crunch the juniper berries. <laughs> Remind
reminds me of like some place where like in the very old industrial revolution days where pickpockets and oh, crime yeah, yeah, yeah. sprees. Like Ramcat Alley. Yeah, the they'd just watch people stumble out of the gin bar and rob them blind. Ooh, look at this. Uh-oh. Folk <laughs> God, I hate it when I get this body, Herbert. I know. <laughs> Especially on vacation. Oh, it's impossible to get rid of. It'll take a couple of days out of your out of your trip. Coco, why can't you come out today? I've got the spotty Herbert. Thomas olives and salsa. Mm -hmm. I'm a sucker for extremely <laughs> twee, cute British pubs. Well, you're in the right place. <laughs> <laughs> Kitchen's cook shop. Cooking's kitchen. There's a front window. Truffle brie. Uh oh, what's going on here? Is there like a party happening? No, I think it's the next one down. Upstairs party. <laughs> There's an upstairs party. The salamander.